Power electronic circuits, control and convert electrical energy from the available form, usually public AC grid. Or DC battery. To the load requirements. With high efficiency. All power converters are implemented with switches to achieve high efficiency. Rectifiers convert the available AC energy to the DC energy required by the load. Cycloconverters convert the AC energy to the AC energy with variable voltage and frequency. Choppers convert the DC energy to the DC energy with variable voltage and polarity. Inverters convert the DC energy to the AC energy with variable voltage and frequency. The drawback of using switches is the appearance of harmonics. To understand power converters, we set the task of controlling the brightness of an incandescent lamp, which is powered by an 18 volt DC source. Lamp resistance is not constant, but increases with current due to temperature. The simplest method of controlling power and brightness requires connecting a variable power resistor in series with the lamp. The use of a transistor in place of the rheostat is more convenient in practice. By changing the base current of the transistor with the trimmer, the collector current flowing through the lamp is adjusted. Therefore, the transistor acts as a variable resistor, controlling the power and brightness of the lamp. The transistor operates in the active region, resulting in power losses. The losses and the temperature of the transistor become maximum when the current takes the value of 68 milliampere. By operating the transistor in the saturation and cutoff regions, therefore as a switch, the disadvantage of low efficiency is eliminated. A switch, in the conducting or on state, allows current to flow, while the voltage across its terminals is extremely small. Accordingly, in the blocking or off state, the current is practically zero and the voltage across the switch is high. Therefore, in power converters implemented with switches, the losses are insignificant. When the transistor acts as a switch, the power control to the lamp is provided by the PWM signal with an amplitude of 5 volts. The frequency of the signal must be high enough so that the brightness is constant. A frequency of 50 Hz is sufficient for the human eye. Regardless of the frequency, the duty cycle of the PWM signal determines the RMS value of the load voltage and current, thus, the brightness of the lamp. The temperature of the transistor is only 23 degrees Celsius, as the power losses are extremely small. At 8% duty cycle, the RMS current in the lamp is 68 milliamperes. For the same current, the transistor temperature was 93 degrees Celsius in the conventional circuit. The disadvantage of using switches in power converters is the appearance of harmonics. As a result, the transistor consumes reactive power. The DC source supplies the reactive power to the transistor and the active power to the load. The apparent power is equal to 1 22 volt ampere. The efficiency is nearly 100%. In the conventional circuit, the DC source supplies only the active power of 1 22 watts, which is equal to the apparent power of the switching converter. The efficiency is just 33%.